Okay, you've got two quarts now that you've worked on. And so what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and see about trying to put it all together. I realize at the beginning it's going to be a little bit slower, as you should realize as well. And so the main thing is just kind of transitioning from the G chord to the D chord. Take your time. The main thing that we're really going to try to focus on is being precise, playing the chord the way it should be played. So basically, when you play the G chord, you're going to want to play all six strings. And then when you transition to the D chord, you're going to want to play strings four through one. So just the bottom four, trying to not touch the top two strings. It's going to be a little bit difficult at first, but with a little bit of time practicing, it'll come pretty easy. And so anyway, here is the G chord. All right, and now we're going to go ahead and transition to the D chord. Now we're going to go ahead and transition back to the G chord. Now we're going to go right back to the D again. Okay, and now what we are going to do is we're going to go ahead and just put it all together. We're going to transition from the G chord to the D chord and back again. This right here is going to be simply just going from the G chord to the D chord. There's not really a lot to it. The main thing right now just to focus on is just transitioning from one chord to another and then back again. Now, as we go further into the next few lessons, we are going to be adding more chord. And so what's going to happen is it's going to definitely make your rhythms much more interesting. The main thing that we're focusing right now on is just building a good foundation that's going to allow you to have the ability to start making some music, uh, but you've got to start small. And from what I've found, by just starting small, it's going to allow you to actually put something together, and then we're going to build on top of that as we go further. And so anyway, go ahead and continue practicing. The main thing that we really want to focus on is just practice, practice, practice. The more time that you put into this, the more you're going to get out of it.